We can start on the all-weather series now. This is a 0-85 handicap. And I'm going to go and have a one mile and six furlongs. And at the top we've got Trapanga Eyes for Darren Thompson. Hills Patchy for Dan Hughes. High Rise for Craig Beckwith. Patch Patch for Stu Gray. Mini Fortune Heat for Daniel French. Still Game for Alex Cherry. Whitechapel Tan for Martin Lidham. Jack Cherry for Stu Gray. And Dancing on Ice for Obi-Wan. So nine this time. Quietly installed, ready to go. And away they go. A little bit slow to go on the far side. I was dancing on ice, but that's an OB1 horse that'll probably burst through and take the lead in a minute. It's Trapanga Eyes who's currently got that position. Well, those two grey horses are to the fore as well. Patch Patch, a winner last week, and Jack Cherry. And it's Patch Patch who's going to go on from Jack Cherry in second. The second of the greys on the near side, Mini Fortune Heat. The one on the rail, though, is High Rise. The OB1 horse did get away. Slowly it's now moved through into second. That's Dancing on Ice looking to the back. Hills Patchy is just the back marker. So it's Patch Patch who's in the lead and Hills Patchy who's at the back. So Patch Patch then by four to Dancing on Ice second. Still game is in third. Then Whitechapel Town on the outside of Jack Cherry in Mini Fortune Heat and Trapanga Eyes. With in fact, Trapanga Eyes is now just the back marker. But it's Patch Patch who's in the lead then as they're into the final furlong, uh, the final 10 furlongs with Dancing on Ice second and still game in third. In Whitechapel Town being pushed along around the outside. Jack Cherry is going with that one down on this near rail. It's high rise alongside that one. Mini Fortune Heat Hills Patchy is going to try and go between the two of them and Trapanga Rise the top weight. He's just trying to make his mind up whether to challenge on the inside or the outside. But it's Patch Patch who's clear then hitting the mile pole from Dancing on Ice in second and then still game third Jack Cherry on the inside is going well Whitechapel Town on the outside stepping up in trip is in fifth then comes Mini Fortune Heat High Rises next Trapanga Rises now moving around the outside of the pack and Hills Patchy and High Rise are just disputing last place but it's the Stu Gray pair and Jack Cherry's come to challenge stable mate Patch Patch for the lead then there three lengths back he's dancing on ice in third Trapanga Rise is just cruising to fourth place and looks to be going on and actually well the top weight Whitechapel Town is next then still game Mini Fortune Heat Hills Patchy's going to try and get up the rail High Rise is out the back but the Stu Gray pair is still disputing the lead the Gray Jack Cherry closest to us last week's winner Patch Patch over on the far side they yeah, three lengths clear of Trapanga Eyes and then Dancing on Ice, Mini Fortune Heat, Whitechapel Town and Still Game, Hills Patchy, High Rise is now switching to the centre of the track they've got three and a half furlongs to go and Jack Cherry's just about got his head in front of Stable Mate Patch Patch, Trapanga Eyes though looks to be going really well also now running on his Dancing on Ice, Mini Fortune Heat, High Rise is making a forward move around the outside as well as Jack Cherry hits the front, Jack Cherry then by a length to Stable Mate Patch Patch in second, Trapanga Eyes isn't fighting much under pressure, then comes still game and Mini Fortune Heat, but it's Jack Cherry who's gone too clear, Jack Cherry's too clear with a full and a half to go, it's Jack Cherry now beginning to pull away from his stable mate Patch Patch, Trapanga Eyes has found nothing and Jack Cherry is racing inside the final furlong, he's well clear and he's going further clear, the only one who's getting anywhere near him is the second grade Mini Fortune Heat, racing up towards the line, Jack Cherry he's got a hold on, it's going to be another one for Stu Gray, Jack Cherry takes it, still game is second, then Trapanga Eyes and Hills Patchy and Mini Fortune Heat, and it was a pretty comfortable win for Jack Cherry, set up by stable companion Patch Patch. Really, Trapanga Eyes looked to be going like a winner for most of the race, but just didn't find anything under pressure at all, and even got ran out of second by Still Game. So Jack Cherry wins it for Stu Gray. Still Game was second for Alex Cherry. Trapanga Eyes for Darren Thompson was third, Hills Patchy for Dan Hughes fourth, and Mini Fortune Heat for Daniel French was fifth.